Intrepid journalist and adventurer Nellie Bly always said, nothing is impossible if one applies a certain amount of energy in the right direction. Nellie's own energy in the right direction sent her whizzing around the world in 72 days, alone and literally with the clothes on her back, to shatter the fictional record set by Phileas Fogg in Jules Verne's Around the World in 80 Days. On the day her race ended, 10,000 people packed the train station in New York City as she stepped off the steam locomotive and into history. It was the most remarkable of all feats of circumnavigation ever performed by a human being, the New York World newspaper declared. It was 1890 and Nellie Bly was a global celebrity. That this fearless heroine had faded into oblivion inspired me to revive her, to bring her back as a reminder that we can achieve the impossible. My journey began 125 years after hers. Like Nellie, I traveled alone with one small bag. The ocean liners that transported Nellie have vanished, so I took to the skies with a round-the-world ticket. Nellie journeyed through the Victorian age, pushing boundaries along the way. I streamed through the digital age, blogging as I went. She raced, I didn't. We both finished with book-length memories, gratitude for the kindness of strangers, and an unshaken belief in humanity. Nellie set out to break a record, dismissing anything that got in her way, prejudice, peril, even the need for luggage. The 25-year-old journalist had never sailed on a ship, held no passport, spoke only English, and worst of all, she was a woman. My aim was to celebrate how Nellie defied convention, took a walk on the wild side, and explored her own place in the world. I wanted to shine a light on the histories, one of history's forgotten heroines. Nellie Bly pioneered undercover journalism and paved the way for women in the newsroom, like me. Throughout her career, Nellie's reporting exposed injustice and oppression. She gave voices to the vulnerable. It made the world she circled a better place, and it still does. Even so, the story that brought her the most acclaim was the one that I reenacted for my book, Following Nellie Bly. Please join us for a trailblazing voyage around the world.